My name is Frank Yost and I'm co-founder of KetoNade. My connection to this whole world of ketone esters is through my wife's godfather, Dr. Richard Beach. He's one of the world's leading experts in ketone research. Now, my company, KetoNade, will be launching the world's first ketone ester, KE4, available now to the public. The most anticipated exogenous ketone to ever hit the market. It is D beta hydroxybutyrate d 13 butane dial non-racemic and salt free dave asprey spent once over twenty-five thousand dollars for half of what's in this serving jimmy moore said that it might come out for a thousand dollars a serving and for the last few months we've been supplying pro athletes the entire supply that we have but because of the demand people have been asking for it saying when are you coming out we decided to go ahead and launch the first batch so this is exactly what ben greenfield took when he went over seven millimolars on his blood test and he had the race of his life kale leo grande pro cyclist he said that he had a 50 percent longer workout 30 percent more watts and was not sore the next day he was blown away david nurse nba shooting coach he said that he felt like superman this is what everyone's been waiting for. Nothing else can come close to this. It's impossible to reach these levels of DBHB with the products that are on the market right now. The reason this product is so revolutionary is that right now it's impossible to deliver this amount of beta hydroxybutyrate with the exogenous ketone salts that are out there. Dr. Richard Veach, he worked with non racemic ketone salts 15 years ago. It did not deliver enough energy, enough D beta hydroxybutyrate. For example, we have Keto Sport, one of the first exogenous ketones, Keto Force, and you'd have to drink 10 servings of this to match what's in just a four ounce drink of KE4. And the amount of salt that's in this, let's take a look. It says beta hydroxybutyrate 11.7. I give them kudos for listing the amount. That's very good. However, it's racemic. Racemic means you know, there's the L form and the D form of different molecules. And this one, beta hydroxybutyrate, the D form is the one that the body can use. If you calculate the amount of beta hydroxybutyrate in here, you'd have to drink 10 servings of this. The amount of salt that would be required for 10 servings would be over an entire restaurant shaker. Just all of this. Other products followed the lead of Dom D'Agostino's research and decided to add MCT oil to the ketone salts. A great idea. However, there's a drawback. MCT oil, even one tablespoon can take weeks to get accustomed to. And the amount of those other products that you'd have to take to deliver 60 grams of DBHB would be 12.5 packets. And if you do the math, that would be six tablespoons of MCT oil. And my wife and I, we drink Bullproof Brain Octane every morning because we love it. And one day, my wife went from one tablespoon to two tablespoons by accident. And let's show you this video of what happened to her. I feel like there's fire in my gut and I'm gonna throw up and I'm sitting down and I'm dizzy. Oh, I feel so sick. So some people might say, but wait, Prove It has a product now called Biomax. It's more bioavailable. The ketone salts, you have to drink a lot of water with them. So you'd have to drink the equivalent of six of these 10 minutes before a race, an entire gallon of water to deliver the amount of D beta hydroxybutyrate that's in here and a whole ton of salt. That would be 7.5 packets. It's just not an attainable solution. Instead, you just drink four ounces of KE4. And if you wanna know what it feels like to go over five millimolars in 15 minutes, then put in your bid right now. Also, I would recommend that you actually buy two of them, one to try at practice, and then one to try on game day. You don't wanna go straight into game day with this. Also, it might be months before it comes out to the general public again because the pro athletes have been taking all of our inventory. So thanks for watching. Please share this video and happy bidding.